take acting classes. It's 95% acting and then 5% about the voice. Um, but I always like to say mimic. Mimic everything. Mimic cartoons, mimic teachers, family members, people you meet on the street. Mimic, not to their faces, uh, but like, Find your voices and discover what you can do with your instrument. And that's the best way, I think. That's the way I did it. But I was fortunate enough to work really early on uh, on Transformers Rescue Bots. Noble. Which was an ensemble record with some of the greats. You know, there was Maurice LaMarche, and uh, you know, he's the voice of the brain, and half the voices on Futurama, and um, I got to work with Steve Bloom, and Mark Hamill would come in, and... What?! So crazy! There are too many people to say just one. One person in particular, or two, who are kind of my mentors, helped me a lot when I was first starting out, is uh, Art Butler and Mick Winger. Um, they, they both have been, like, so good to me. Mick is the guy that I kind of credit as the guy who took me from being an unorganic actor to being an organic voice actor. And I think that was like so cool to have him in my corner when I was starting out. It, there's no magic to it. It's just hard work. And I think that's how I consistently am able to book work is is I, I treat every audition like it's the big audition. Hey, Daddy-o, welcome to the Adam Cats, the coolest club in town. And maybe that comes back to bite me in the butt sometimes, like maybe I spend too much time on an audition, but I care. I care about what I do, I have fun with what I do, and I want people to know that that this is, you know, this is what I've, I dream of doing, you know, as a career, and, and if that's, if I wanna make this my career for the rest of my life, I know the kind of work I need to put into it. Is my favorite character is the next one that I'm gonna play. And it's true, it's like, I, what I look forward to most is like that first day on the job when you're creating that character, when you're working with the director to, to mold that character and, and explore who that person is. That's always so fun for me. Um, but my favorite character, <laughs> All of them, I don't know. I mean, that's what also what I love about this job is that I get to do so much during a day. Like I could do three, four, five sessions and they'll all be different. Maybe one will be a commercial, another one will be a promo, and then I'll have like two animation things and a game. Like you could have a day like that and you could be playing yourself, an old person, uh, uh, you know, a dragon, whatever it is. And I love that about this job is that there's so much variety and you get to spice things up so much.